So the first creepiest enemy would have to be the fluorescent flower from Bloodborne. Yes, of course, it's from Bloodborne. Every creature from Bloodborne is creepy and crawly and wants to kill you, and I could probably make the whole list on just Bloodborne creatures, but I'm not gonna do that. Anyways, the fluorescent flower is a big centipede-looking predator armed with tons of teeth and legs. Its head has tons of bioluminescent tendrils that squiggle every which way. On top of its head, it's got a fluorescent flower-like nodule that hangs down almost like an anglerfish. It's thought that maybe this is a sensory organ. When it's about to attack you, it looks like it's pulling the power from the cosmos in its head because a small vortex starts to form. This thing is straight out of the Lovecraft handbook and probably from another dimension. As a hunting method, it'll lie underground waiting. The only exposed part of it when underground will be the flower. So when some unsuspecting person goes to pick that flower, that person becomes a meal. Yeah, I think the world could do without mobile Venus flytraps from another dimension. Even if they are cool as fuck. So this next creature is called the Divider from Dead Space, and it's probably my favorite creature in any game ever because it's just so damn creepy. It's a former human that has undergone mass mutation. The limbs have become elongated and become very slender, while the fingers have fused together into elongated claws. Rapid degradation of the flesh has left holes all over its body, especially in its abdomen where the organs have either fallen out or been assimilated. Most of their muscle mass has fallen off, so their limbs are held together by tendrils that have formed over the mutation process. Basically everything about these guys is pure nightmare fuel. You can usually tell when a divider is around because it emits a weird bellow-like whale sound that bounces off the dark corridors. And when it does see you and go into attack mode, it lets off a spine-tingling shriek. If all that isn't enough to convince you that the Divider is one of the creepiest enemies in gaming, well, they also have the most brutal death animation I've ever seen. Let's just take a little look-see here, shall we? The last terrifying creature on this list would be the Rasclapanye from Resident Evil. I think it's just the way they move and contort, and when you unload shells into them they twitch in odd directions. It's just very unsettling. When you first encounter this thing, it's already torn to shreds and dead, or so it seems. And then it starts regenerating in front of you, slowly rebuilding itself. That's why the whole street is on lockdown. Residents are trying to keep it out. Well, this one is different. A terrifying B.O.W. indeed. It looks like it was almost mixed with some kind of leech DNA. Maybe that's why they're extremely weak to fire. Everybody always mentions the Regenerators in the Resident Evil series as top-tier scary. But I'd say these guys give them a run for their money. And I'd give their death scene a solid 7 out of 10. 